Yo! What's going on everybody? Hey, I'm back here with the next installment of the FNAF Help Wanted playthrough. And uh, this one we start FNAF 2. Um, you may hear some noises in the background and some kids music and stuff playing. That is because it's still actually pretty early and my son is still awake. And he is right behind me on my bed actually hiding underneath all of the covers watching stuff on my switch so um yeah let's get this going uh unfortunately because my son is still awake and i'm playing this game i can't really turn off all the lights at the moment because that just i need to be able to see him first and foremost secondly I don't want him to happen to come out from underneath the covers and then see see Mangle right there or something like that and get scared, you know? He's just, uh, just a little guy still. So. Uh, I'm here to talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down this new and exciting career path. Alright. Uh, now, I want tell you me. to forget tell me, you may guy. have heard about the old location. You know? <clears throat> so what we're uh, going to do here is I kind of remember from my uh, original playthrough of this is basically I don't while, think I but, uh, lost I any of these you. nights once in my original playthrough off camera. All, I think maybe the black uh, light uh, mode night 5 I lost once but other than that I literally didn't today. lose any of the nights except for maybe uh, one on night four or night five and what the strat was obviously playing in flat mode i don't have a vr headset but what the strat was was keeping the camera on cam 11 holding circle down on on one hand and then with uh with my thumb and then basically using like a claw grip, using my pointer finger to hit the flashlights for everything, and then my middle finger for R1 to move over to this vent. And yeah, that was that was basically it, and I didn't have any trouble with any of these nights except for maybe four or five. I distinctly remember losing one night, but I don't remember if it was night four or night five. So but yeah, try to find where the people are. that's the strat. Case, that's We're gonna keep that going so our temporary is throughout this whole playthrough, and we'll see how that ends up working. Wait, Bonnie moved already? So okay. every once in a while, I mean, the thing... Oh my gosh. Stop talking, dude. The, the, uh, the music them. box lasts for so uh, long that you could probably let it go. At least on the first night, you could probably let it go until, I don't know, like 4, maybe closer to 5 a.m. and not have any problems. But, yeah. I'm just going to look around quick to see if I can't find Bonnie, because... Uh, I heard something. It's kind of the quirky modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. <laughs> uh, but hey, you have a light, <laughs> and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about now, the place going dark. <clears throat> I know that all of his, all the phone calls are just ripped straight from the original PC game. But I see. What I don't know is right there when he says that. You can't run out of power. The building can't run out of power. But your flashlight... Can oh, I see. He's he's sneaking. He's getting in that vent. Anyway. When he says that the building can't run out of power, but your flashlight can run out of power, is he talking about these lights? Uh, I don't know. Just, if, if anybody knows, if they could let me know in the comments, that would be great. Because I... I don't know. Like I said, I know the phone calls were just ripped straight from the original PC versions of the game, or at least it sounds. It's so close that it's a very good trick. If so. But, um, 
If not, I mean, rather, if not. <laughs> Sorry, I got a little flustered there. That big blue boy in my face like that. But yeah, um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So, if anybody does know when he says your flashlight can run out of power in the FNAF 2 section, if he's talking about these lights that you hit with square, that would be great. I mean, by the time anybody <laughs> even would comment that, this series will be over because of the way I'm filming it. I don't know who... Oh man, are we done? I didn't even see Chica. I didn't... I honestly did not even see Chica. Let's see where Bonnie is. Somebody's coming. I got a feeling it's Balloon Boy. Oh, look at that. Don't even have to worry. <laughs> yeah, anyway, as I was saying, um, if somebody could let me know what flash... If the flashlight he's talking about that can run out of power are the lights that you hit with square, that would be great. Just for future reference. But, by the time anybody would comment that... I wouldn't even have use for that because the way that I'm doing this is the there's so many little sections that I basically am just filming each section r off the rip right straight no pause so like FNAF 1 all night back to back until it's complete FNAF 2 all nights back to back until so on and so forth so I won't really get a lot of actual practical use out of that information but it would still be kind of cool to know Let's have a snack. <laughs> All right, we're moving. We're moving. Getting these nights done. Things are going swell. <clears throat> Excuse me. Whoa. Oh yeah, I forgot. Helpy can uh, pop up there. How you doing, pal? Been a long time. So yeah, let's uh, let's get it going. Night two. Hey.